This is the Ark of Dreams. I said, damn, that bike's heavy when it's all loaded. Because <laughs> that's funny. We literally stayed, we literally closed a campground. Alright, so we're just sitting here mapping out the next What are we doing? <laughs> we're sitting here mapping out the next leg of our journey. And guess what we found out? From Deadwood to Tennessee. To Tennessee where our son is. Is thirteen hundred miles and we had not And we're gonna do it in a twenty four hour period. We're gonna iron butt it. <laughs> no we're not. No we're not. No we're not because Thank the dear Lord to Z Traveler and Bunker Biker. Yep. We are wandering through there for the next three days and hitting up some awesome Bunker Bikers. So we're just kind of setting out our route and we're contacting them. And so far, everybody has responded back. Yep. So it looks like we are good to go for lunch day. All right, so that's what we're doing. Yay. So we'll see you on the road when we start hitting up these Bunker Bikers and tell you about it. Where's all the bungees? Are they in the dry box? Nope. I have no idea. Well, they must be in, they must be by the tent. Well, let's go look. Huh. So we've been looking all over for our bungees. Guess where I found them? Back at our tent site. Right there. Guess what I found? <laughs> you could you could hardly see them. That's what I thought. I was like, you know, unless they're hanging on that, they were on that that pavilion. Yep. yep. There you go. All of them. All, All of, of them. them too, right there. But I, we're not going to need them. Okay. I've got everything in there. The only thing we're lacking is the grill and the two beds and the computer bang. Yeah. Oh, okay. So two. about just a spur of the moment thing. We saw a sign for Badlands National Park three miles away. So we're checking to see what it looks like because maybe we just want to go It looks like it's just wander through there. It looks like it's just there's the visitor center so for lunch it's getting warm when we're playing that game Chris and Rich where did you stop and have lunch today 
Badlands National Park. Wasn't even on the agenda, just poof, there it is. Hey, we're hungry. We packed a sandwich, let's stop and find a picnic table, and we did. I mean, <laughs> you can't get any better than that. Yep. Richard's gonna do a quick something. <laughs> well, I gotta put some air in. Oh, we'll let we'll let Richard fish, finish his uh, his business here before we get our our stellar shot. <laughs> Thank you so much for opening your home. So we wanted to give a shout out to Kevin and Camille. They were our fabulous Bunker Biker hosts and they took us on a, an amazing tour of Sioux Falls and the entire downtown area. Sioux Falls a few years ago our mayor um, decided they're going to try to beautify downtown and they created what's called the sculpture walk and artists create sculptures and they put them on different corners throughout every downtown. year all down mm -hmm. all through downtown uh -huh. and then they you can go pick up pamphlets and you can rate the sculptures and at the oh. end of the year the city buys one and usually some companies around Sioux Falls will buy oh, other but, ones. But the one uh -huh. that is the community favorite gets like $5,000. Yeah. That sculptor will get $5,000. Nice. Yeah. Oh wow. So, but um so then this, this this is the Ark of Dreams. It's doing really good. <laughs> huh? All right, so let's see. Leg one of our journey across from South Dakota to Tennessee is over. We're leaving our fabulous Bunker Biker host today. We're now we're headed to our next Bunker Biker host in Topeka, Kansas. Hopefully, because I wrote the address down wrong, and so we're waiting for him to reach back out to us. <laughs> Could have stayed here for a week, partying with these guys. But. We'll do it next year. I think uh, I think we're gonna be hanging with them in Sturgis next year. That's what I think. What do you think? Uh, I think we can hardly wait to get back together with them. Yeah. They're fantastic. Yeah, we, we had a blast, so <laughs> it was cool. We had a blast. There so you go, that's good. It was too late. Yeah, it, it got to where it was just, you know, late for us. Because we have to be on the road today. We have another appointment or another bunker. Okay. All right. See ya. So we heard from our bunker biker and he said, do you plan on being on the road early Wednesday morning? I'm generally on the way to work by seven. You mean Tuesday morning? Which bunk biker is this? Because <laughs> this is Barb. Oh. This is the lady Barb. Okay, this is not where we're going tonight. Not where we're going tonight. But she said, you know, I'm really out. I said, I said, we will not hold you up and be out the door with you. Yes. Yes. So this is her very nice way of saying. Yeah. You need like to be out of the house by a, seven. <laughs> I don't know you from Adam. You don't need to be hanging out at my house and <laughs> I, when I'm not here and trusting you to lock up. Exactly. Totally get it. <laughs> totally understand. Okay. I'm just trying to keep them straight because we got three right in a row. So. We got three right in a row. So this one, this is not Michael. This is Barb. The, okay. We are her first bunker biker. Yes. And Michael today is, uh, he's a, a fan, I guess. He watches us all the time. So that's kind of fun. I know. Excited to meet him. Yeah. It's going to be cool. How low was it? How much no, How much oil did you have to have? You only have to put it in about a half a quart uh, between both holes, so we're good. Oh, it's okay. Not, it, wasn't, it hasn't leaked. It's just, you know, making a mess. I know, but we're, you know, only 300 miles into our 1,300 mile yeah. run. 
we'll, like, we'll stop by a Harley dealership, you know, pick up some Zen 3, and then uh, go from there. See how see how bad it really is. Thing. It's just when we stop, there there it is. Wow. Not just not what you want to see when you're traveling. Or even if this was in your garage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's just not what you want to see. We're staying on this road for 94 miles, and we're 104 miles from Michael's place. Okay. Michael and Diane is their name. Oh, okay. Our second Boca Biker. So, so I got a leak. I got an oil leak, so I don't want to just park it in your driveway. Hi. Good morning. <laughs> got a little wet, a little hit the dew point yes. here. Yes. All right, so we're getting ready to leave our second Bunker Biker. And let me tell you, I've been having a really good time. <laughs> so Is it sleeping in the bed? Oh, well, that bed was really comfy. Yes. Yeah, that bed was really comfy. But it's part and part a lot of it is the company and uh, some of it is the food. Like the first night, chicken wings. Yeah, you with, really you don't eat that stuff all the time. No. Yeah. We, well, it's hard to cook chicken wings in a skillet. Last night it was pizza. <laughs> Hard to cook pizza in a skillet, but I am going to figure out a way, because, <laughs> yeah. I think if we get a, we need a cast iron lid for our pan. Maybe, yeah. So we are oh, in. Oh, and we learned a trick. What? We got to try. What? The, the, the dried beans. Oh, Some dried beans yes. to make biscuits. To make biscuits so we don't burn them. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And so today, we're going to make our way to St. Louis, the other side of St. Louis. Yep. Um, but, but we're also in search of some Sin 3, is that what you call it? Yeah. Sin 3 oil for the Harley, which has decided, to, you know, she's marking her spot everywhere. And I apparently... got a clutch cable that's leaking. That's what it is. Uh, so... so when I get to a place, we need to call the dealership in Nashville and make sure they have a clutch cable so when we take it in. Okay. Your Harley just needs another couple days in the spa. Is that what her problem is? It's, uh, <laughs> it's a bit ridiculous. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Just a restaurant. It is. On halfway, halfway between Kansas City and St. Louis. It is. Look, everybody looks so pretty over there. Federal Park Service. Hi there. Is this the Moonshine Harley Davidson? Yes, sir. It is. Um, hey, hey, look. I need to uh, schedule some service on my Harley. I'm traveling. 
right now, and um, I'm gonna be in Nashville on, on Wednesday, so. Yeah, what do, you, what do you need done, buddy? Well, it's, it's leaking, but it looks like it's leaking from the clutch cable, not the fitting, but like the cable itself. I've never seen corn that tall before. Even in Texas, it doesn't get that tall. So here's your little farmhouse, honey. I mean, I'm assuming this is it. This has to be it. This is here. Hope some farmer ain't gonna come out and shoot me. <laughs> Boy, what you doing in my yard? An auction. Uh, and yeah. then she had married my grandfather, who was a Detmer. So they had it from 45 to 62. And then my parents bought it from his parents. And so they had it from 62 to 12. And then my dad passed away, and my husband and I bought it, so we're starting a 2012 dash whatever. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That's there used cool. to be windows there that the yeah. storms knocked out, and so I'm like, you know what? I didn't want just dead space. Yeah, yeah. So exactly. Yeah. So we. And uh, who's did the 